hi welcome to my channel thank you so much for stopping by i really appreciate it and thank you to those of you who bought my uh thumbnail artwork on bags on amazon thank you so much i really appreciate it thank you i'm still working on the rest of the videos as soon as i'm done as soon as i'm done with the artwork i will link it on the description where you can find the tote bags that go with the uh, each video but I'm almost done. I think most of the videos have their own bags now. Okay. And uh, thank you. Thank you. This is my Bleaker Coach Bleaker Bucket Bag. This bag is one of my favorites because I love bucket bags. I really, really like bucket bags. I think they are my favorite bags. And the color. And the stitching. This bag has insane stitching this is what you call good stitching okay and the color the color reminds me of our vacations to New Mexico we used to go to Albuquerque and then we drive to Arizona we go to Silver City Tucson Phoenix it's really nice drive that area is like New Mexico is like very like spiritually amazing when you're there when you're standing on the ground it's like you feel like you're standing on a, a dish it's like this dish and the sky is like so close and you can see where the where the earth meets the uh the the sky it's like you can walk to the edge and you feel so it feels so amazing to be there it's one of my favorite places I recommend it if you want to go somewhere nice spiritually that place is nice that that New Mexico is really really nice I really really like it and I really like the way you feel the, the sky the way you you feel the earth it's like I think it's because they don't have so many trees here you don't see the, where here you don't where I am now you don't see where the the sky meets the the earth like flat now that is one of my favorite things to see to see the earth meeting the sky okay it's nice it's a good thing to see it's a beautiful thing to see now this is my bag and I like this bag. I really 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 love this bag and this bag is a heavy heavy duty bag okay it's insanely made the buckles are like big look at this buckle look at that look at the color of this this oh my god I love this leather I love this bag I think I am getting insane with bags maybe I'm I'm getting too many wow look at that Mmm, that feels nice. Feels nice. This bag feels nice. It's buckety, but it's not like round. It's like this, this shape. I don't know what that is called. And it says Coach since 1941. It's beautiful. Look at this. Look at how that is made. That's a good bag. That is a very, very well made bag, okay? Look at the stitching. Stitching, look at the stitching. Oh my god, that, now that is a good stitching. You see how tight it is? But yet nothing is wrinkled. That's a good stitching. When you have like tight stitching and one breaks, you don't have too many, too much space. So it's still gonna be okay. And it's also easily fixed and it doesn't show as much when you fix it compared to if this like wide wide stitching is not good wide stitching does not look good this is how you stitch okay if somebody's making leather bags they need to look at coach leather bag mostly the bleaker this bleaker has the best stitching it also has my favorite, favorite, the zipper, the big one. Okay, look at that. When you condition your bags, and you want your zipper to do that, not get stuck, just condition your zipper. Put a little oil on your zipper, 
and then it will not it will go faster okay you want this stuck this hold on this is the side it's a, a little bit big bag but it's not like it's not as big as my um my duffel sacks i think now i have six six duffel sacks i'm gonna show them to you sometime sometimes i'm gonna show you all of them when i get time when i get time i'll show you everything okay i put some bags in it that i get i buy bags so i can fix them okay i want to fix this one i got this one at the flea market i like the way it's made it's very nicely made i don't know who made it i don't remember but it way back i don't know how much i paid for it hold on let's put it here i, I was using this bag for a few few weeks then i found this one at the goodwill the other day i found i found this one so i had to move and try this one and see if i like it this is also really cute really nice i had this bag way back in a big size and i didn't like it so i gave it away i think i gave it to my sister and uh, the other day i went to goodwill and i saw this one and it looked really it's very comfortable to wear this bag this one maybe i'll do a video on that one too maybe but i have a lot of bags i can do videos on. and this one is also coach i bought this bag um it was colored ivory and it was like really dirty okay and i painted it i painted it green because i don't have many green bags and i wanted to see what it would look like if i painted it so i bought it for a dollar and i painted it I painted the zipper so much and it came out really nice. This bag is too small for me, but it's very comfortable to wear. Very comfortable to wear. Somehow, I don't know how it got so dirty on top, but not inside. Inside is not dirty. It's like clean. Very clean. Almost like new inside. Hold on. Let's see if I can open it to show you. This is becoming like two bag video or ten bag video. Hold on. See, it's clean. Nothing wrong with the inside. It's good. I got this 99 cents the other day. I had Goodwill the same time I bought that one. I don't like this. I just bought it. Because I'm hoping someday I'll learn how to make giveaways. How to do uh, giveaways. So I can do these. I can give away this stuff. All of this stuff. Things that I don't use. And I have a lot of bags that I'm not using. So... I'm hoping I can give them to somebody who can use them. Yep. This is the inside. It's got two pockets. One is big and one is small. And it's got a zipped pocket. It's got the creed. It's got a D-ring somewhere. Hold on. What is that? It's got a D-ring D for your keys. Okay? It's on there somewhere. The um, tag is big and you get the big uh, these things this is big it's not like a usual one it's a big one it's got the horses the horse one horse it says coach it's very very nicely made look at the color of that this is a beautiful beautiful bag just when you buy it watch out for this problem it got it's got where it fades like this that and on the lip maybe if you're getting it if you're gonna use that to see this part because this is part that wears off the most and the the um the strap because the strap loses this like it lost it on this uh, side here like that you want us to see the edges of the strap it's got this braiding thing it's really really nice also this inside this because this is you can use this as a, a crossbody bag or as a shoulder bag but this becomes a little bit scratchy when it gets old okay it gets scratchy i don't know why i conditioned this when i conditioned this on portland leather it wasn't it doesn't do that it it, it stopped being scratchy okay but this one wouldn't do that this one 
that's why I double it. I don't want to, I don't like touching this a scratchy part, okay? I don't like touching that. It's not. Oh, so. This is good. It's a nice bag if you can find it in a good condition. It's a beautiful bag, okay? It's amazing. It's amazingly stitched. You see, stitching is very, very important for nomads because you have to do good stitching or your stuff is gonna go apart. Like if you're making a tent, you have to do good stitching or the water can go through. Okay? So that's why. I remember when we used to stitch. I remember the woman with the good stitch is famous. Okay? Gets famous because she's a good stitcher. I'll tell you stories about stitching leather tents and leather stuff when I was young later someday but right now I have to go because I have to paint and I have to do some NFTs and I have to paint I have a lot of things to do so I'm gonna go thank you so much for stopping by I really appreciate it please subscribe like comment thank you thank you thank you so much bye bye